Here's a very interesting question. What is pi? Assume we draw a circle of radius 3 cm. It will look something like this. As we know, this red boundary of the circle will be its perimeter. We have a special name for the perimeter of a circle. It's called the circumference of the circle. But how do we measure the circumference of this circle? The circumference is round and the scale we use to measure any length is straight. It's simple. We just place the red line like this, like a straight line, and measure this length using a scale. This circumference of this particular circle will measure approximately 18.85 cm. It means if we draw a circle of radius 3 cm and measure its perimeter, it will equal 18.85 cm. Let's also note the diameter of the circle. The diameter of a circle is 2 times its radius. So the diameter will be 2 multiplied by 3 which equals 6 cm. For this circle, these are the values we have for circumference and the diameter. Now let's draw a circle of radius 4 cm. This time as well, we measure its circumference. This red mark will be the circumference and to measure it, we make the curved line straight. This will be the length of the boundary. For this circle, we get the circumference as approximately 25.1 cm. The diameter will be twice its radius which equals 8 cm. So we have the circumference and the diameter values for each of the circles. Now here's the best part. If we calculate the value of circumference by the diameter in the first case, we will come up with approximately 3.14. What do you think will be the value of circumference by diameter in the second case? Guess what? It will be the same. Approximately 3.14 again. No matter which circle you look at, this value of the circumference by the diameter will always be approximately equal to this value. This value is called pi. Remember, both these values are approximations. As circumference by diameter equals pi, we can say that the circumference of a circle equals pi multiplied by the diameter. If we call the diameter d, then the formula can be written as pi multiplied by d, which can also be written as pi multiplied by 2r because the diameter is twice the radius. So the circumference of a circle is written as 2 pi r. This is a very important formula as it gives you the value of the circumference even if you just have the radius of the circle. There's another important thing about this special constant pi. We get the same value if we divide 22 by 7. So the value of pi approximately equals 3.14 or 22 by 7. <laughs>